Acumatica 2017 R2 Feature Review, Item Class Hierarchies. The Item Class Hierarchy is a feature that was originally required to meet the needs of hardware stores. These types of businesses sell small component parts with complex item class structures. With Acumatica 2017 R2, you can now create parent-child relationships for item classes. This will help to organize and classify items, help you navigate easily through the classes, and assist in mass updates of parent-child item class relationships. You can now use item class hierarchies across Acumatica reporting, for inventory cycle counting, replenishment, and much more. Here we see an example of an item class hierarchy for the parent class, Electronics. Underneath the Electronics class, we see there are three child item classes, Audio, Visual, and Accessories. In the next layer down, we see two items that are part of the Audio child item class, the Sony speaker and the Sound Touch. We also see an additional child item class for the Audio category, Headsets. There are also two items that are included in the headsets category. In our demo, we will see how this configuration of an item class hierarchy results in efficiencies for our sample organization. On the segmented key screen, we have added the ability to filter by lookup mode. For my subaccount ID, when I select the lookup mode by segmented key, that means when a user enters a subaccount in any document, it can be entered through the lookup as a complete value, not a segmented value. If I use the lookup mode by segment, all available segment values, that means that the user can enter the subaccount segment by segment with no lookup available to them. For item classes, there is an exception. For item classes, I have a third lookup mode available to me, which is by segment, child segment values. This means that I can create a tree structure for the segmented key when using this lookup mode for item classes. We have added a new screen called Inventory by Item Class. On this screen, you can get a clear picture of your item class hierarchies, their parent-child relationships, as well as the items that are included in each of these classes. You can choose to show the items that are related to only the current item class, or also the items that are related to the current and child item classes. If I select the child item class for electronics audio, for example, I can see the two items that are part of this category, the Sony speaker and the sound touch. From the item classes screen, we have added the action to apply to children. This means that if you make any update in the item class and then apply to children, all of the associated children classes will be updated. For example, if I now look at the audio item class that is a child of electronics, I'll see that the allow negative quantity checkbox has been carried over to the child item class. This applies to replenishment settings, attributes, and much more. We have also added the ability to configure availability calculation rules for your item classes. With availability calculation rules, you can decide for your item classes the mathematical formula that goes into the availability calculation. For example, should we include quantity on receipts, include quantity in transit, or maybe include quantity on purchase orders? We have also added the item class filter to several Acumatica screens, such as the prepare replenishment screen. You can now select the item class that you are looking to prepare replenishment for, as well as the child item classes that are associated with that parent class. We have added a report called Sales Profitability by Item Class and Item. On this report, you can clearly see the tree structure for your parent-child relationships and your item class hierarchies. The report shows the parent item class, a summary for each child, and then the total aggregating amount for each item class. Acumatica 2017 R2 enables companies with complex item structures to manage the parent-child relationships between their item classes. You can now use the item class hierarchies across Acumatica reporting, for inventory cycle counting, and in many more areas. For more information about Acumatica 2017 R2 or item class hierarchies, please contact your local Acumatica reseller or reach out to us at info at